Thanks for taking the time to check out the Tiger pregame show and our Clemson historic picture of the day. Like us on social media and subscribe to this channel and click that notification button if you would like to get updates. Today's photos are of Red Parker, who became Clemson's 19th coach in 1973. When Parker arrived, he told a humorous story as described by Joe Sherman, and I now quote from Joe Sherman's book. I had just gone to my first coaching job at Fordyce, Arkansas, the hometown of Paul Bear Bryant, one of the greatest coaches in the game. Fordyce is a really small football town, and all they could talk about was Bear Bryant this, and Bear Bryant that, and Bear Bryant the other. As a very young, very green coach, I was intimidated. About the second day on the job at Clemson, I was sitting alone in my cubbyhole of an office when I saw two citizens coming down the hall. When they were about 30 feet away, I grabbed the telephone and started talking kind of loud. Now look here, Bear. I've told you everything about the offense that I can over the phone, and I've got work to do here at Clemson. I'll try to get away one day and come down and explain it to you. By the time the two men were in the door, I held the phone away from my mouth and told them, I'm talking with Bear Bryant right now. I'll be with you in a minute. Then back to the phone, I said, Look, Bear, you'll just have to stop calling me during the season. You and Bobby Dodd are just about running me crazy asking about the offense and defense I'm using here at Clemson. I'll see you after the season, and I'll try to help you all that I can. Then I hung up the phone and turned to the two fellows standing in the doorway and said, I'm sorry, I had to help Bear, and he had a little problem. Now what can I help you folks with? They looked at each other, and then one of them said, Well, nothing really. They just sent us over here to hook up your phone. Parker's career ended at Clemson at the end of the 1976 season.